Virgo, take my love. Hey, my love. What's going on, my king and queen of coins? My soul try my sisters and brothers with go on Virgos. I am feeling like turning up the tea. Let's make the tea a little bit hot tonight and see who we can style in this evening and who may be in your energy, who might be thinking about you, what's going on with your current situation. All right, Virgo, in love. So let's see what's going on, Virgo. I'm excited to see. I hope each and every one of you are doing really good. I guess y'all were like, this video is kind of boring. Turn it up some. Let's get the tea piping hot tonight, okay? So let's see what's going on. I am your nightcap for the evening. What is up? What is up? Okay. Let's see. And of course, I'm Empress Meek. And this is Closer to My Destiny's Tea. Where the tea is never too hot. I always serve it with a multitude of love, 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 love. And just right for you. I hope you're feeling good. If you're not, uh, it happens. But I know that my high vibrations and my positive energy is going to raise your frequency a whole lot higher because I love you and that's what I'm here to do okay and it ain't hard for me boy it ain't hard for me I guarantee you'll get a good laugh you'll smile you'll crack a smile or you'll have a positive thought after watching each of my videos okay so let's get into it Virgo let's see who is in your energy and what's going on in your current situation for the Virgo Sun Moon Rising Venus and North Node Holy Spirit, the monster, the holy angels, what you got for the Virgos? Thank you, Spirit, for keeping us out of harm's way. Thank you for blocking and bonding any negative energy, entities, witchcraft, wickedness that may be coming up against this channel or our lives. Thank you for keeping me whole, full of love, peace, and light. So I can plant seeds of love, spiritual guidance, and wisdom into the Virgos and whoever is drawn to my positive energy and the titles of these videos. Thank you, Spirit, for giving us victory in each and every situation, being light in the time of darkness, a friend in a time of need, and holding our hands when we feel alone. Thank you for healing our hearts, minds, bodies, souls, and spirits, and giving us abundance and overflow. Amen, amen, and amen. Let's see what's going on for the Virgos. What you got for my Virgo Collective? Let's see, how can I make Virgo's path a lot brighter and then load a whole lot lighter? What do they need to know? Wow, okay. So autumn is going to be harvest time for you, okay? You've been working on the inner child and healing things about yourself so you can cut out these limiting beliefs and limiting self-limiting behaviors. You want to know what made you do some of the things you did and what makes you accept some of the things you accept. These are the cards that are actually saying that in autumn, you're going to see a lot of change, a lot of growth. Um, maybe an elevation is going to happen involving you healing your inner child. All right. You're going to get some type of epiphany and understand what has been going on the whole time. I'm getting that the dots are going to be connecting. All right. Exactly. You are working on your shadow side, doing a lot of self love. Okay. This is you doing the work, Virgo. Okay. And while you're doing the work, guess what? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. You see it. Somebody spying on you, trying to follow your every move and see what you're doing. Okay. This person has been obsessing over you, missing you a whole lot. I'm getting that this person feels like a whole jackass for letting all of this happen in the current situation. Okay. It's something that this person wants to do. Okay. Um, this person could be very controlling, all right, and very manipulative, okay? So there's things about this person, and I'm not feeling a total horrible energy when it comes to this person. I'm actually feeling like this person is not the worst person, but I'm also feeling like this person is very controlling, okay, and has a lot of controlling ways about them, all right, that really affects the relationship. I'm also getting that there is something that they want to tell you. It's some kind of truth. That they are coming, want to come forward with Virgo. There's something that they need to tell you and they remember everything that you said to them. Now they remember how much you meant to them. I'm getting that you changed this person's life. You changed this person's world. And because of that, this person wants to come back to you. This person actually is ready to bear their truths to you. Whatever it was that this person was holding back from you, they're ready to say it, okay? Okay. This person really wants to have a reunion with you, all right? This person feels a lot of strong energy when it comes toward, when it comes to 
you and them, okay? This person feels your energy all around them even when you're not there, all right? This person um, feels... Okay, so first of all, this person had an awakening, okay? This person has had an awakening. They have been doing a lot of shadow work just like you have. You triggered this in this person when you actually rejected them finally and actually stood on it and meant it. No matter how you were feeling in your heart, you did not go back, all right? And this made a drastic change in this person's life because you were this person's crutch. You are this bi this person's biggest narcissistic supply. Like you made this person feel on top of the world and able to do things that they couldn't, they didn't feel like they could do on their own. So Virgo, this person has been doing a lot of healing their inner child. There was a lot of things broken in this person when you guys met and when you were trying to have a relationship that this person didn't expose to you. Some things they did, but they didn't really open up and tell you really what was going on in their inside, okay, like they should have. And now they're thinking about what this connection was and they're realizing how much you really meant to them. Gratitude is here because this person is actually grateful for everything that you did and everything that you were to them when they had you, Virgo. Yes, this per look at this. This person has gone through a lot of storms. This is going to cause some kind of shakeup when this person comes back, all right? This person is going to be admitting everything to you, and this is going to really catch you off guard. This won't resonate for every single person. It's impossible for it to resonate with all of the Virgos, but for a group of you, there is something that this person wants to express to you. Whoever it is that had a person that you left, it was a very strong connection, okay? Could have been a lot of soul ties there. It could have been a lot of controlling um, in this situation. This person could have really strong control tactics. They could have triggered you to be a little bit controlling, all right? But this person has been watching you for a very long time. And I'm feeling like in autumn, you're going to hear from this person, okay? Something is going to come about where you're going to hear from this person. There could have been a lot of you mirroring each other, okay? What's this storm? Why is this storm here? I feel like, yeah, this person is going to come back and offer, make an offer to you. This is going to catch you so off guard, Virgo. But this person is going to come back and make you an offer. All right? This person really wants to be back with you. This person feels lost without you. You changed this person's life, okay? The way you walked away from this person and left this person... You rejected them finally and they were so used to you constantly forgiving them. This has made this person think about everything that has happened, okay? It could have been a year since you've talked to this person, all right? But they have been watching you the whole time. You didn't know. They didn't say a word. They didn't tell you this. You don't know. Some of you could feel it, but this person never stopped feeling your energy. This person never stopped remembering the times that you shared. This person really cared about you and this could also be a person that you were with when you were younger you guys could have been young in a relationship growing learning things but learning things together and at the time there was a lot of lack and a lot of doubt from this person's end that this would not work they doubted that you were the one so they purposely sabotaged this relationship they did and when this person reaches out to you it is going to rock your foundation you are going to be so shocked it's going to be so unexpected and, it, and and I feel like the unexpected storm card is here because this is going to trigger your shadow side. This is going to trigger the things and the feelings that you felt when you were with this person. All you really wanted from this person is for them to tell you the truth so you can heal properly. This person used this as a way to control the situation. They refused to give you the truth. They were used to you because you didn't have the truth coming back to them. To, to heal, being able to heal with them giving you something to work with, okay? But this time you said, F you, F your apology, I'm going to heal without it. I'm not ever coming back to you. And that's what you did, Virgo, but this person, okay, this person is coming back to offer you something. And I feel like they are ready, they really are going to be trying to commit to you. Wow. Wow. I hope y'all ready for this because it's gonna it's gonna happen in autumn. Expect it. You don't even have to expect it. I'm not telling you to manifest anything that you don't want. 
This is a preventative reading. This is a reading to prepare you for what's to come. And this person, you changed this person's life. It's no way this person could forget about you, Virgo. They're not. Pay close attention to the details, okay? Pay attention. And also, this makes me feel like this person has been watching you very closely. Pay attention to the details in this reading for you. And for also for them, they've been watching you very closely, Virgo. And you had no idea. You thought this person was going on about their business. Yeah. With the tower card, um, this could represent stability. Okay. This could be um this could be even this person wanting to marry you. All right. With this tower card, this represents stability, longevity. Okay, something that's not easily tore down. Okay. This is you building something stable from the ground up, okay? It makes me feel like it's something um, built to last, okay? That's that's what just came to me. Thank you, Spirit. Something built to last. So this is what they failed to do when you were together. This is what they regret not doing. And this truth that they're about to bear to you is going to have you thinking about everything, okay? It's going to cause a storm. It's going to cause... a uh, it's going to cause an upheaval of emotions and the way your life is running right now, how you've been by yourself and doing things on your own without this person and trying to heal from this situation. Yeah, it's going to feel like it's going to feel like troubled waters at first, but there is light that's going to come after the storm. And also this light represents this truth. This person is going to shed light on everything and help you better understand what they were feeling, what they were thinking, and what actually went on in this connection. This person is going to want you to take a chance on them. Absolutely. This person is going to want you to take a chance on them because they've been through an awakening. Okay? This person has gone through an awakening and now they remember. When I feel like this person was with a karmic that was doing spell work. All right? A water sign karmic possibly that was definitely doing spell work on them. This person had them confused and they began to treat you like the enemy. Okay, they deceived you, they backstabbed you, they manipulated you, they took advantage of your kindness, took your kindness for weakness, Virgo, I know. But this is that person that wants to come back and give you a confession now. This person wants you to take a chance. Mm. Look, this person could be coming back to propose to you, Virgo. And I feel like for some of you, this person always used to say that you guys were going to get married. This person always used to say that and they really, really loved you. They wanted, they wanted this with you. Look at this. Look at what we have here. At the bottom of the deck, this person is coming back. And they're coming back to make you an offer. They want you to be their wife or their husband. This person is coming back. All right, and this person, when this person comes back, it's going to be serious. They may send you an email, some type of message. You are going to hear from this person again. This won't resonate with everybody, okay? I feel like this is not for the people who this is fresh for. If this just happened, I mean, for some of you, it could be. But I'm feeling longevity here. Like, it's been a long time that you are in a relationship with this person, and it's been a long time that you've been separated from each other. At least three years, and this person did not believe that you would do this. Let's get the tarot out, Virgo. We're about to get a little bit deeper. Let's go deeper. Matter of fact, and I'm going to get the love oracle cards out to see what this person wants to say, because this is serious, honey. Wow. Okay, Virgo, I can't believe this, and you are going to be shocked. You're going to be shocked by this. You really are. It's going to it's gonna cause a total upheaval. I feel like Spirit is saying, remember. Um, remember what you've learned in this connection and how far you've come, okay? I'm feeling like that's going to be very important, okay? Yeah, this person, I, this person wants you to know that they were doing that because they needed to heal. They were very broken. It was a lot of things in their heart that hurt, you know? It was a lot of things about them and their lives that they were not proud of, Virgo, and it really hurt them. It hurt them to the core. Um, some of them got abandoned by their parents. Some of them felt like they had to raise themselves. Some of them um, got abused, you know. It was a lot of things that happened to them that made them seem like a villain, okay. It made them not be able to trust people fully, and they went through a lot of heartbreak, okay. 
I'm feeling this very seriously. And this person finally has had a breakthrough. They finally see what this connection was. They're going to, um, they've been watching you very closely. They're going to come with the truth, shining light on the situation. And not only that, they are coming with the offer. Let's get into the tarot and see what's up with this person. And what is this trying to say? Oh my God. This person wants to balance karma with you. Wow, Virgo. Let me see. Hmm. Whew. This is just, wow. Okay. <laughs> Seriously. Spirit, show Virgo clearly what the messages are. What is this person doing? What's going on with this person? What's happening here for Virgo? Let me just see something. Wow, where's my deck? Oh, here it is. I just want to see what this person might want to say to you. This person is saying that they were pretending to be someone else in your connection. They weren't prepared to handle this relationship. And right now they're reminiscing about you, Virgo. Yeah, they were pretending to be somebody else. They're not ready to... They weren't ready to be the man or woman that you needed them to be. For Virgo, clarify this message, Spirit, please, for Virgo. What is this person thinking? There was a lot of fights, arguments, and conflict when you guys were together, and this person did not know how to deal with it. Their answer was to go and find somebody else. They think the world of you, and they always have. It's the you for them, honey. I know. They treated you like crap because they felt like crap. And that was the only way they knew. I'm feeling like they were around a bunch of toxic family members that were very promiscuous, didn't encourage this person to do right. They didn't care about this person's heart and them being happy. They really did not. All right? I dive in and out of relationships. So this is what this person was doing. There is so much they want to tell you, and they are coming back to tell you this stuff. They have to see what happened is spirit pushes this person because karma needs to be balanced here. It, I feel like there is so much that has happened between you and this person. Karma is not balanced for them because they did not do what they were supposed to do. Look at this. Our story isn't over yet. This is serious, Virgo. Oh my God, this is serious. <laughs> This person is coming back. This person says, I pulled away because I'm overwhelmed with all the things going on in my life. And that was a lot of this stuff this person bought on their self. But a lot of it had to do with their toxic family and how they weren't accepting this connection. They were making, they were giving this person hell. Could have something to do with the cancer. Okay, but this person wants to come and visit you with this chariot card here. All right. Let's see. Spirit, clarify this message for the Virgos, please. For Virgo, for Virgo Collective, what is going on? Wow, Virgo. This person sees you're single, and this person also is single. Um, whoever they were dealing with, they left this person. What's going on with this person? What do they want with my Virgo? Wow. This person is wondering who you're with. They're wondering if you have options, and they want to know if you're single. I mean, they know that you're single because they've been watching you, but they're not sure. They want you to be theirs, okay? There was a lot of confusion between you two. This person wants to know who you're dealing with. If you have options, what's going on? Are you in a relationship? Because they're coming back. They're coming back to confess to you and let out all their secrets. They care about you, all right? And there's no more hiding from them. They have been in hermit mode for a long time reflecting. This could be another Virgo, okay? Um, or this could be a Scorpio because Scorpios also go into hermit mode. I feel that very strongly. This could be a Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. A hermit represents Virgo, okay? Um, this person wants you to know that they brought a lot of confusion in this relationship. They were giving into temptation big time and they were not using their intuition. They had a lot of, um, they had a lot of healing to do. It was a lot that they indulged in. And you shine the light on this person and their secrets. You found out about their options and all that. This person knows that. And the fact that this person knew, found out that you knew the type of person that they were, 
it hurt them. It hurt them so deeply. It pushed them into a transformation. I'm telling you, Virgo. And look at this. They want to rush into you and talk to you, um, tell you the truth and talk to you, bear their souls to you because they love you and they're ready to balance karma. So some of you, you thought this person was long gone, honey, but this person has been waiting for the right opportunity to come to you and now they've made a decision. So by, 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 by autumn, I'm getting that they're not going to let your next birthday pass for some of you. For some of you, they are not going to let you have your next birthday without seeing them. They are coming in to balance the situation to balance the scales with this justice card, okay? They want just they want to give you justice. They know that you want justice in this situation. They betrayed you with their confusion and their toxic ways and them not using their intuition. They're they're admitting that they did not use their intuition in this connection with you. And they regret it. They are sorry. They are, I have to be honest with you, Virgo. This person still loves you. This person still loves you. And when you were in a relationship, there was a lot of fussing. There was a lot of disrespect. There was a lot of, um, and you could have been very angry with this person and very disrespectful toward this person because of them sneaking around and lying because of the things that they were doing to you, Virgo, because of a third party. I just saw it. And they had you in this queen of swords energy and that's not your energy, right? But this person is not feeling trapped anymore. They're feeling free now, and they're making a decision to come towards you and tell you the truth. Wow. This could be a Scorpio, but they definitely want to tell you the truth of what happened about this ending. They want to talk to you about the ending, what happened between you guys and when you left them. This is the Ace of Swords. They want to start talking again. They want to reconnect with you. It hurt them to the core when you left them. They haven't been able to think about anything but you. Yeah. And right now, they're ready to defend this relationship. They're ready to defend this relationship and everything that they had put in it before. They, they want to show you that they've grown and they have your best interest at heart. They want to show you that they're sorry about all they did with the cheating and having you waiting. And they want to come back and offer you this Ten of Pentacles. They want to be straight up with you. And they want to work on things. They do. They really do. So, Virgo, this is what I have for you, my loves. This person will be coming back. They will be coming back to heal things. They want to invest in healing things. Something that looked like it couldn't be healed. They do. Wow, Virgo. This is serious. <laughs> this is deep. I wanna get I wanna get like a couple romance angels to see what comes out because this is deep. It really is. Show me spirit. Speak holy angel. What messages do you want to get Virgo regarding this connection and this person? What do they need to know about this? What do Virgos need to know about this message? Oh my God, something flipped on the floor, Virgo. Hold on. Healing family issues. So this is what this person has been doing. This person was very broken, forgiving and learning. This is what this person wants to do with you. Wow, what else? New love, they want to start over, a new chapter, a new love, a new relationship, and then romantic feelings. Wow, your feelings are worth exploring. It says your feelings are real and worth exploring. So Virgo, this is telling me that the love that you experienced with this person, even though they made you feel like you were crazy, it was real. And I'm feeling like the love that they felt for you, they always knew it was you. This person's coming back to let you know how they feel. They can't stand to see you single. They don't want anybody else to get you. They want to be able to show you that they love you and care and they have changed. Wow. This could be worth waiting for. I feel like this is the version of them that you wanted. This is the version of them that you should have had. It's up to you if you take this person back. But this person is definitely coming back to talk to you. This person is coming back to confess some things to you that they should have confessed to you a long time ago. And they were being too controlling 
holding information, trying to be able to control you to keep you being, keep you chasing. And instead you let them go and they did not expect that. This pushed this person into a whole, a whole life change. Like they changed everything. They worked on everything. Um, Virgo, you're going to be shocked when this person comes back, love. Oh, Lord. <laughs> this is going to be deep. Let's see what else. Mm. Definitely some hot tea tonight. Whoa, all these cards just flipped over. So we're going to use these three. They just like literally flipped in my face. So let's see. We got answered prayers. All of your great work has opened the door for divine solutions and support. We also have let yourself feel all your emotions. And I feel like especially with this situation, your entire rainbow spectrum of feelings is sending you important messages and guidance. And then we have give it to God. Wow. Take a deep breath and hope and and it says on the exhale, release this situation to God for healing and answers. So spirit wants you to come to him. Come to him about what you should do about this person. I'm getting pray first, ask first, and wait for your answers. Don't just go off the handle. Control your anger. Control your mood. Temper yourself and pray. And ask God, what is this? Why is this coming back? And what am I supposed to be doing? There will be a reunion. And there will be some truth told. This person is going to bear their soul to you because they love you still. And this is going to shock the hell out of you. I'm telling you. All right, Virgos. Whew, you can talk to me in the comments, honey, because this, this was deep. Okay? I will see you sooner than later. I love all of you. And if you want to look more into your story and this resonates with you, I'll be happy to do your personal reading. I am still doing them. The email address is closer than number two. My destiny, the number one, at gmail.com. Just breathe, Virgo, and you can ask Spirit what you should do now. Because somebody is definitely coming back to bear their soul to you. They love you, and they they life has not been right for this person since since you left. Whew. Bye, y'all. <laughs>